Hi, and welcome. I am so glad that you're here, and I'm so excited to share this preset pack with you. I'm Anna, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to download your new presets so you can start using them to make your images brighter, lighter, and more vibrant. Now, one thing I wanna note is that this tutorial is being done on an iPhone, but the concepts used will transfer to almost any device. You ready? Let's get started. The very thing that brings these presets to life is the Adobe Lightroom mobile app. So our very first step will be to download the Lightroom app to your device. Go to your app store. From there, I want you to search for the Lightroom mobile app. The icon for the app will have an L and an R in the center of it with a teal blue ring around the edge of the icon. Now on your phone or device, you might see the word get instead of open, but because the app is already downloaded on my device, I will click open. And then I want you to create a free account or log in. Now don't worry, you don't have to pay a dime for this app and there aren't any ongoing subscriptions. Simply log in. I'm gonna to choose to continue with Adobe because I have an account with them. Put in your email address. and your password. And then beautiful. You're all logged in and Lightroom is ready to go. Now I want you to navigate back to your email. Go to where the preset pack is accessible and notice that it's a zip file. Now, if you're familiar with iPhones, then you know that zip files are not supported with this technology. So we need to download an app that will allow us to open this zip file on our iPhones. I want you to go back to your app store. From there, I want you to search for the app called iZip. Now any app that unzips files will do, but we're gonna use iZip for this tutorial. I want you to download iZip to your device and then open it. Ignore the big advertisement and continue to iZip. Perfect. Now go back to your email. See at the very top right-hand corner of the screen where there is a blue box with a blue arrow coming out of the top? I want you to click that and then look for the iZip icon. We're gonna copy this zip file into iZip. Ignore the advertisement once again and continue to iZip. Perfect. It's asking us if we wanna unzip all the files. We do, so hit okay. Ignore this advertisement. Wonderful. All the presets are here in this folder. But now we need to copy this information into Lightroom. So I want you to click on the very first preset that you see. Notice the title. It says AF Bright with Black Preset. So we're going to choose to open this preset into Lightroom. So click Open In and then choose Lightroom. I want you to click Launch Lightroom Now. Beautiful. Do you see how the preset photo has the words bright with black on it? Essentially what we're going to do is copy this information from this photo into Lightroom. So I want you to go to the top right hand corner of your screen where there are as a circle with three dots. And then I want you to choose create preset. Name the preset with the name found on the corresponding photo. So for instance, this one was titled bright with black. Because I wanna organize my presets, I'm gonna put AF in the front of it. Wonderful. Click done and then check the check mark at the very top right hand corner of the screen. Now this preset has been added to Lightroom. This is awesome. I want you to do this for all other presets found in the folder and then come back to this tutorial and I'll show you how to use them. Now that all nine presets have been added to your device, we get to do the fun part, which is use them. So you're going to need to import photos onto the Lightroom app. So what we're gonna do is go to the bottom right-hand corner of your screen. You're going to see a blue pill-shaped icon. There is an icon to the left of it that looks like a white picture with a plus sign on it. We're gonna click on that and then import photos from our camera roll. I'm gonna go to my favorites folder because I have a couple images in there I like already. Then I want you to select the images that you would like to edit. And then once you're done, click add. From there, tap on the individual image that you would like to edit. This is Judah and I, my son, and we are about to do story time. His dad captured this. Isn't it so cute? 
On the bottom menu bar, you will see a series of different icons. I want you to scroll to the left until you see the word presets. Now you might come to this option where it says user presets and then there's a downward arrow and then it has all the presets that you've downloaded from the Bright Bliss preset pack. Or you might come to this option where it says color and then a bunch of names. These are simply Lightroom's presets that they have given to you for free, but we don't want to use those right now. We want to go back to user presets. So, so simply click the name color and then click user presets. From there, I want you to click through the presets and see how each preset does something different. We've intentionally crafted these presets to fit a variety of different photos and different photo styles. So you see how they each do something different. That's a good thing. Pick your favorite. This image was shot in artificial light at nighttime. So I love the way that artificial light looks. Select the arrow on the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. And then to export your image so you can find it on your camera roll, go to the top right-hand corner of the screen. There's a white box with a white arrow coming out of the top. And then you can share to, or if you look down, you can select export to camera roll. That's what I'm gonna do. And ta-da, your image is found in your camera roll. Use it on Instagram, you can use it on Facebook, you can send it to your mom if you want. This is a great way to use these presets and I hope that this tutorial has been helpful.